it's Mary and it's time to become aware, tuned in, connected to ourselves and to set our intention for today. We're taking it one day at a time like we always have, but now more than ever I think it's really important to be present, to be connected to yourself, to be really tuned in and listen to your, your intuition, your own inner knowledge. And take a break from the external distractions. I want you to really pay attention to how you feel after you listen to the news. How you feel when you're scrolling through social media. Do you need a little bit of a break from all of that? If it's getting you charged up and riled up and in fear. We can't be in fear. Not that we're burying our heads in the sand. Be updated. Be informed. But let's shift the energy. Let's shift your energy first and let's shift the collective energy so that we can be healthy and stay healthy here and in mind, body, and spirit. So let's begin. You can either close your eyes, bring your attention inward, or have your eyes open. Gaze to the tip of your nose. Then take a nice, long, deep, cleansing breath in through the nose. Let your belly expand, body open, Exhale through the nose or mouth, letting go. Let's take another nice deep breath in and let go. Allowing your soles and feet to be soft, crown of head to sky. Allow the muscles in your body to soften. Let the shoulders relax, releasing the burden off your shoulders. Being present in the here and now in this moment. Bring your hand to your heart center, the chest. Just feel your presence. Feel the energy from your palm to your chest. Maybe you feel a little bit of heat or tingly or just notice your physical hand on your chest. Bringing your energy, energy down into the heart. Focusing here on the chest and the heart. In this moment you just notice the body's breathing itself. You may notice the gentle, subtle movements of the body as the body breathes. You don't have to make it breathe. There's no effort as long as you're healthy. Just noticing the breath. Just noticing the breath. Notice the gentle movements under the palm. Notice the belly moving with the breath and the belly soft. And as you focus here, notice that your jaw and your face are relaxing and the shoulders are softening. Put your soles and feet to the earth. Imagine a tube of light coming out into, into the earth from both feet, down into the earth, all the way down to the center of the earth, anchoring you there. And imagine a tube of light coming out of your tailbone, down into the earth, all the way down to the center of the earth, anchoring you there. And imagine a beautiful white light coming up through that tube, coming into the root chakra, the bottom of your spine, forwards. This is your root energy center. And imagine that light circling around, opening up, bringing that root chakra into balance and harmony. This is where we store fear. So if you find maybe you have any hip issues, leg issues, tightness, digestion issues, it's connected to the root chakra, it's connected to fear. So take a deep breath in and as you exhale, exhale with a ha, let go. Imagine that light coming up in the second chakra, the navel area, and allowing that chakra to cleanse and clear it open up as the light circles around and brings it into balance and harmony with ease and grace. Take a deep breath in and exhale the ha, let go. 
Now imagine that light coming up into the solar plexus, the third chakra, the third energy center. So allowing that light to circle around and allow that chakra to open up. Take a deep breath in. Exhale the heart. Let go. Now allowing that light to come up into the heart center, the chest, the center of your chest. Take a deep breath in. Exhale the heart. Let go. Bringing the heart center back into balance and harmony. Good. Allowing that light to come up into the throat chakra. Allowing the throat chakra to cleanse and clear and open up. Take a deep breath in and exhale with the heart. Let go. And allowing that light to come up into the third eye, in between the eyebrows. And allowing the third eye center to come into balance and harmony with ease and grace. Take a deep breath in, exhale with the heart, let go. And allowing that light to come up into the crown chakra, the top of the head. And allowing the crown chakra to cleanse and clear and open up. Take a deep breath in and exhale with the heart, let go. Imagine that light coming out in your auric field, cleansing and clearing your auric field, bringing you into balance and harmony with ease and grace. Take a deep breath in and exhale the heart, let go. Let's take another nice deep breath in here. Feeling grateful that our energy is brought back into balance and harmony. Helps with helping us stay healthy and in vibrational harmony, which is super important now and always. Take a deep breath in, exhale with a heart, let go. On your next in-breath, bring your intention to mind. Today I intend to, whatever it is you're intending. With that intention of mind, take a deep breath in. And exhale, let go. With that intention of mind, take a deep breath in. And exhale, let go. Let's take another breath just to bring this into a completion and anchored and grounded and centered and courageous. Take a deep breath in. And exhale with the heart, let go. Let's take another breath. And when you're ready, opening your eyes. Excellent. <sighs> How does that feel? How do you feel now? Come back and re listen to the chakra clearing. It's my main video on my YouTube channel has it. You can get it there and keep it. Um, also this, you can come back and listen to this. To keep your energy and your chakras in balance is really important right now. The energy centers, the energy field, and allowing all that energy to flow is important. Because if energy is stuck, it creates disease. It's not Your body is not functioning as it should. So let everything process through any emotions, whatever needs to process through. Um, yesterday I was feeling, I think, I don't know what I was feeling. I definitely felt emotional, but I'm not sure where that was coming from. And I just felt off balance. I felt tired, um, grumpy, and I was like, what is going on with me? And I know enough to take a break, take a pause. Usually when I'm at that point and I notice that I'm emotional eating, I'm totally off balance and that's the time for me to self-care like never before. And so I took a long hot bath and Epsom salts and essential oils. And then I went on my yoga mat and just lay in Shavasana and just took some deep breaths and just breathe, 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 breathe. And um, because my mind can't hold a lot of information, especially late at night, I color now. I have a coloring book. I had, I've had it before, but life gets busy. So I have a coloring book, and I just color that. And I just, my mind just calmed. I felt my body just uh, relaxed and, 
and recharging and I slept so well last night um, so that is, I'm just sharing that as be very aware of your emotions you could be feeling it collectively or it could be yours um, do what you need to do in order to keep you in harmony and balance within yourself maybe it's a bath maybe you need to sit by your plant um, Maybe you need to add mood lights in your home. Maybe if you have candle, light a candle at night and be grateful for all that you have. Um, maybe it's the smell. Maybe you need essential oils or a nice smell, <clears throat> a nice essence in your home. So whatever, figure out what feels good to you that supports you right now in order to stay calm and connected and tuned into you. All right. I know that was a long one. Um, and here's our affirmation before I forget. So our affirmation is, hmm, I see myself through the eyes of love. I see myself through the eyes of love. And here's the message. Look in the mirror and say, I love and accept myself exactly as I am. I love and accept myself exactly as I am. And that's with situations too. We need to accept what's going on right now. Not that we agree with it or we're okay with it. We need to accept it so we can be part of the solution and um, keep our energy high. So when I mean accept, I mean, okay, this is what's going on. How can I help? Okay. So I love and accept myself exactly as I am. And here's and keep, keep saying it until you really feel it. Keep saying it until you really feel it. Okay. All right. I hope you're doing well. I am sending you so much love and blessings and a virtual hug. Please let me know how this helped you. Leave me a comment and hit the share button and share with your friends. The more intentional people we have in the world, the better. I am teaching uh, a class tonight, an online class. It's my regular Tuesday night class at 7 p.m. If you'd like to join me there, that would be great. Um, and then if, if there's anything you need, if there's anything you want me to offer um, that supports you, please reach out. If you just want to chat, please reach out. I am here for you. Have a magical, wonderful day and take good care of you. Talk to you soon.